This is to make sure the block I'm about to mill is perpendicular to the cutting bit. Ready to go. Now that the cutting bit is in, here's the other check. No gap, zero clearance. Well, a few cuts have been made already. Seems to be going pretty good. Here you can see. Move it in, loosen up the carriage, bring it in, fit, tighten the carriage, and here we go. Turning it by hand. Taking small cuts so I don't stress the, the lathe head, the milling head, or the jig. It does a little wobble towards the end. I try to go slow, but it's going to definitely jump it a little. pretty slow. We're going to speed it up a little. Back it out. It's on E now. Make it twice as fast, three times as fast on to C. You have to grab the uh, the worm gear sometimes to get this to disengage and re-engage. Here we go. A lot quicker feed now. See if it's too quick. Just about right.
engaged. Bring it back. Clean it up. Bring it in for the next cut. Lock it. Engage. By the way, let me show you the back end of the college chaser. There it is. You have to push that out that way. That draws the collet in. Push it out, it releases it. Seems to be holding the bit in very well. Okay, now we're taking off the top part to match the bottom. We'll do the same thing to the opposite side. Doing the final touch to match. Here it is, both sides shaved down. My first milling job, the best in the world. Here's where the, the bit loosened up in the collet. I put extra, two extra pieces of tape to hold it tight. Let's see how it fits. Just got to cut out those little angled parts on the top left and top right that you see the marks scribed representing the top of the T there. Having the core slide come towards me as opposed to a way it's doing a better cut so the bit isn't trying to climb up onto the piece. Much better cut. No vibration so far. Let's see what happens when we get deeper.
Well, here it is, half done, as far as the T portion. Really came out fantastic. Right on the line. This is it, the final pass, the final cut. Well, here it is, the finished nut, mill to perfection, show you how it fits, just a smidgen snug. This nice and snug. Okay, now comes the exciting part. I'm going to add on the tool post holder, and here it is. Straight from China. To continue, this wasn't threading properly, so it uh, pulled loose. Now it's in proper. Make sure we have it hanging over over here properly. Nice and tight. Feels good. Test it out. Get myself a little tool bit holder. Slap it on there. Lock it into place. Sturdy as anything. Yahoo!